And before you start, guys, as usual, don't forget leave a like, rate, comment, subscribe, video, and with you in the video description, you find tons and other cool tutorials and video about this mod. Everything for you, as usual. And subscribe for more. I create tutorials every day only for you. Step number one, if you want uh, not only minimap, but also world map, download and install Xero world map and Xero minimap. Not very big comparison between normal and fairy versions. In fairy, not work cave mode, so definitely you cannot see uh, and explore cave system. And also, you cannot see any type of animals or players on minimap or in full screen map. That's how system works. Awesome. Step number one if you cannot see this minimap, not big deal, press Y button. Active press oh, and you activate minimap. After that, also press M button and you see full screen map if you use um, Xair world map. Without world map, you cannot see full screen menu and map. Remember about that. Also, if you want to see cave system, go in underworld as deep as you can, and if you use normal version. You can press M button and explore carefully what type of structure you can see. See one abandoned mineshaft system, see mineshaft number system, and so on and so on. Wait a second, where I am? Um, ah, okay. Here, my arrow. I here and I watch in this direction. Aha, uh -huh. wow. You can teleport with this map in two main ways. Way number one, press M button, you open main menu, find place where you want teleport, for example, this cool beach, press right mouse button and choose option teleport here. It is also work properly for any game mode, game mode no matter here, believe me. I can also, a second option, it is a, a waypoint system. Press U button, you open uh, teleport menu here at waypoint test 10 for example why not here you can choose color a lot of different color uh, what type of reset cobalt moon overworld after uh, not use the system you don't need the stuff anymore here you can change the coordinates you no need change anything here by default totally the same story about global and local uh, local, uh, it is visible when maximum waypoint render distance. Global always uh, distance. It is useful. Global option. It is useful for your house. For example, it is my home, so I choose global, and uh, not visible, but it's considered a world map location. It is see on my full full screen world map, but it does not see on the normal world without any maps, and. Totally the same world map global, it does not see on the world, uh, but you can see in the full screen map, it is useful. So I personally prefer global, confirm. After that, for example, I want to report uh, for another place. You can use full screen minimap, find place, for example, subscribe, press right mouse button, teleport to waypoint, I teleport to this waypoint, see? It is useful. Also, I... Uh, Report in another pre uh, manner, press U button, choose a place where you die at last time, for example, uh, delete, find old uh, place and report to my old uh, death place. Ah, okay, understand. Why not teleport to the village? Du -du 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 -du. Teleport here. Awesome. Uh, you can disable, for example, and you not see, not use the stuff when it is enabled. If you press share, another player in your world can see this waypoint. See? Press add button, and if a player press on this button, they can add this waypoint to the, the own uh, waypoint system. So you can share in this manner. Useful? Yes, on the server especially. You can always press delete and delete, delete, I say. Wow. Also, yeah, a lot of other options, but seriously, it is not very important. Now, how see the settings 
Go in settings, press Y pattern, entity radar settings, display radar, and you see creatures around you. We have a lot different designs. For example, use um, not. For example, use always name every creatures around me. See. Useful. I see everything what spawned around me. It is normal situation because mob can spawn only around players, as you can see. They not exist far away from me. That's how Minecraft work. It is normal situation. Now I want uh, make the dot big entity dot size and deactivate name, for example. Another solution how it is look like. A lot of different points. The yellow it is normal uh, animals. The a red point, it is uh, the evil creature, for example, skeleton or zombie. Because daytime at this moment we cannot see any evil creature. Also, you can uh, use overlay, for example, activate slime chunk and see slime chunk as uh, this green... Ah, no, 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 green thing on my minimap, but I cannot see the slime chunk on the world map. It is strange, but anyway. Um, also, we can uh, chunk use green chunk chunk grid. It is useful when you build something or work with um, different machine from industrial uh, mods and so on and so on. Uh, usually, you know, you know need the stuff as all the in normal gameplay. Believe me. Also, you can change in view settings. You change how look like your and where you can read all the stuff. You can change zoom. Also, uh, by default, you can use only a few options from this mod. So, it is mean, press escape options, controls, cabins, scroll down, find Xaero minimap, where is it? See, all these options not bind, it is mean they have no cabin. Toggle minimap, for example, press left mouse button, you see yellow particles, press button. Now, if this letter have a, a white color, it is mean you set up properly. If have, for example, uh, red color, it is mean uh, this button already you already use another mod. In this situation, choose another cabin. Press left mouse button, this cabin, for example. Now I can press new cabin to activate deactivate main minimap. Useful, useful. In this totally the same manner, you can activate a lot another cool tutor settings from the Xyero. Reserve for radar render orders, which waypoint set, toggle all web, uh, VP sets, render, chunk claim, chunk grid, entity radar, in-game waypoint, light overlay, manual cave system, on waypoint, slime chunks, blah 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 blah. Also, I highly recommend use the main uh, cabins here, in my opinion, zoom in and the zoom out. For zoom in, I choose this option, for zoom out, this option. After that, you can, or I can always use this cabin to change scale on my minimap. I love the system, seriously. More scale, maximum scale. Tan, tan, tan. First five position I find here. Perfect. Also, in view settings we have several another very important stuff. Change size for your minimap. Cool. Uh, lock nose. As you can see, it is mean if you lock nose on the upper side here always find the north, here west, here east, and the is here south. So it does not change direction, not rotate when you move around. It is very useful in my opinion, so always I can recommend this option. Occupacity 100%, 30%, so see how it looks like. Oh my gosh, it is so stylish. <laughs> Anyway, zoom level when enlarged, after, opacity is 100%, center when enlarged, um, shape square, round, so um, maybe big square, for example another type, option how to change scale, see, I can play with the stuff forever, lightning off, with light like off, we cannot see any type of lightning. And with lightning setting, you see all light source at night time on minimap. Remember about that? See? I see the uh, torch light around me. But without light settings, we see only daytime always on minimap. No matter 
what you see at night time. But on full screen have another settings for this situation. It's extremely cool. Also, uh, cool option, it is change the uh, position. You go in this menu, press left mouse button, you change where you can place your thing. Maybe it's the center. Confirm. Yes, you can also choose preset. Top left corner. Or bottom left corner. Or top right corner. Or bottom right corner. Definitely I can play with this stuff forever, seriously. But I prefer on the bottom left corner because it is more logical in my opinion. Thank for watching, recommend, subscribe, videos and resume. I believe I show you all important stuff. Uh, main settings and option for this minimap. That's how system work. Radar, teleportation, uh, waypoints and so on. Of course, if you want teleport on the server, for example, you must have operator rights or maybe admin account. So you cannot uh, teleport on server for free. You know what I mean. You must uh, buy something. Any uh, options from ad server administration. All in the description you find tons and other cool tutorials and videos about Kasaero. I hope mm -hmm. that this video helped you.